So just doing a quick um, update. Uh, it's been over a year now since I had the ICL and laser surgery. I can't remember the exact date I had the ICL, but I was looking through past emails that I'd sent to the hospital and um, I had my PRK laser on the 14th of March 2018, so it's been over a year. Um, all in all, not a whole lot new to report. Um, <clears throat> again, it's it's becoming like allergy season now in the UK, um, so I've noticed my right eye in particular tends to get a bit cloudy at times, um, like the tear production isn't as good as the left eye. It's, it's weird because it's usually the left eye which historically has been worse with the allergies than my right but yeah um, so I basically use eye drops I'm not sure if I've got them with me um, yeah I do uh, see if that shows I get these from the GP the cord Oh, no, it's like a mirror image. Zaylin, I guess you'd pronounce them. They're just like lubricating wetting drops, which seem to work quite well. And I also have this. It's called Opatanol. It's a mast cell stabilizer, which is good. Again, it reduces the itching and the stuff with um, hay fever. Uh, another good thing I still like to use, which I've shown you before is this um, it's still going strong I don't use it all that often but it seems to help a lot when I do um, oh. still got it plugged in <clears throat> see I've got a new camera now as you can tell because the quality is so much better so I can show these things in better detail but I wanted to show before the little control panel um, I was hoping that would focus oh come on there you go so yeah I know it's mirror imaged and everything but it will go up from 35 degrees all the way up to 50 and you can have it on for 10, 15 uh, 20 or 30 minutes and you just strap it around your head and um, I found that works really well to sort of like um, open up the, the glands under your eyelids get all the um, sort of like the gunk out of there and increase your uh, tear film quality um, apart from that yeah nothing to report my vision itself hasn't really changed much um, I have noticed over the past month or so my left eye has got a little bit clearer for some reason. Um, I don't know why that's happened. Like I said, it's been over a year since I had the surgery and now the left eye seems to be, for, some, for whatever reason, seems to be a little bit clearer. Uh, the right eye, no real change. If anything, the right eye is a little bit worse. But again, that's most likely due to the allergies and like it gets quite cloudy. So... As long as I stay, keep on top of the um, heated compress and the eye drops and lubricating drops, um, I'm sure that will go away soon. So, uh, yeah, that's it. I was mainly just doing this video to test out the camera. It's um, Logitech, some C290, I think it's called. Got it on Amazon for about 30 quid or so. Um, so, yeah, hope hope this helps, I thought I'd give you a bit of an update, nothing really much else to say, so, um, I have enjoyed the comments, like, a few of you have, like, written to me and stuff, um, and I've enjoyed, like, answering those questions you might have to the best of my ability, um, for anyone interested, again, I had my surgeries at Moorfields Eye Hospital in London, um, my surgeon for the ICL and the laser was Mr. Bruce Allen. So if you put, uh, it's like B-R-U-C-E and then Allen, I think it's spelled A-double-L-A-N. If you just put Bruce Allen uh, eye surgery, you'll find his website and you'll also find him on the Moorfields website. 
So that's who we used. He's an excellent surgeon and a really nice guy. Um, and is always uh, like available to answer your questions. So yeah, that's that's who we used. Um, and I'm very happy with the results.